Hey guys, I'm Jeff and you're watching Valley Fish. Uh, it's the morning after we got a rainstorm last night, probably quarter inch of rain. It's not too big, but I'm gonna come out here, check on the totes, and I thought I'd bring you along and make a little video. So we're one week after the uh, first round of the parasite treatment. Uh, ended up getting, uh, what are they? The anchor worms on the outside, they actually collect on the outer tail of uh, one of the males that I had so they must have come in on one of my new plants dogs are gonna go crazy but we're treating them they've actually had four rounds of uh, treatment so hopefully the medicine uh, takes care of it all because it seems to be working so we'll get to them but first we're gonna come back here and we're gonna battle the uh, mosquitoes so Last night I stopped in and tried to add a little bit of food and it was pretty bad. So there'll be some mosquitoes swatting. But this here is my half black green tote. And it's looking really good. The plants are doing really good. Um, just need more of them. So this tote all summer long has been green water. And as soon as the green water disappeared, so did my last batch of fry. So what are you doing, birdie? They're being noisy. All right, so mosquito, free fish food. Fish are doing good. Um, just need to get some more cover out here. So I got some plants I'm gonna trim. I'll end up bringing them out probably at the end of the day so I don't gotta play in the water and then any of my other tanks. But I am uh, getting eight right here, so we're gonna keep moving. But the totes doing really good. This one here is the uh, Half Black Reds, uh, Luke Roebuck line. The mosquitoes are still getting me. This might not work out so well. But uh, I got some water lilies in here. Uh, they haven't done anything yet, but the little dwarf water lilies that I got, there's all kinds of uh, little petals coming up. I guess they're pads is what they are, but there's lots of them. It looks really good. So, I kind of like that look. Very nice. This tote, for whatever reason, was clear all summer. And then lately it's just going green water. But I might squeeze out another sponge filter in it. Because I did that in the other ones. And it seemed to clear them up really well. So, we're going to move on. This is my koi fry tote. I say that because there's like 70 fry in here. And the glare is horrible because there's no tree on this one. But there's tons of little koi fry. Like I would estimate at least 50 and probably 70 in there. So in one of the videos that I didn't get to make because my phone overheated, I brought out two of my best older females. Because the females in here are just not quite big enough to start having their own fry. But the glare is horrible can see them it's nice and clear this is the tote that had all kinds of algae there's actually both those females that I brought out getting chased but everything's looking really good I wish the glare wasn't so bad but there you go you can see in there now looking really good this tote basically all my oh uh, god running out of battery uh, but all my house plants that i have inside basically come out in this tote so uh the phone's yelling at me that we're down to 10 percent. so we're gonna get to the last tub this is the one where the parasite problem is uh it was hanging on the tail of one of my males it's just down to one little speck um and his whole tail initially was covered so medicine seems to be working but it's uh, a multiple week of battling it so last time I ever had this it took about a month to get rid of it so I'm hopeful that in about three weeks I won't see any more but these guys are also dropping fry in this tote it doesn't have hardly any cover but there's a I don't know there's probably half a dozen fry in there so and I know it's not coming up that good but I also don't want to get this water on me or anything too close to it so I don't know. It looks like the overflows worked really well. Um, they're not clogging up at all. And I don't see any water lines that they ever get any fuller than what I wanted. So, 
and get to the last one. All right, well, that's five minutes, and uh, I think we're going to call it. So the treatment seems to be working, which is really good. It's a bummer I lost a whole group of fry on them half black greens, but I'm going to get some more cover in there, and hopefully we end up with a lot of them at the end of the summer. So thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.